All right, the last area of the pa the power plant, which is good. Four areas. That's that's about that's a good length for a deer. For some of them. Yeah. Well, some of them get pretty long. The the traffic area one. That was five. I think no, the waterworks. That was like seven. And I I made note that whenever there's an area based on water in a video game, it's always the most tedious and annoying. Oh uh, yeah. Uh, actually, I like Zelda's water area. Okay, no one else does. I do. You don't count. <laughs> the one in Majora's Mask wasn't that bad. Which one was that? Oh, that one. You didn't have the raise in lower water level, that's probably why. No, you had to mess around with the currents. Yeah. That wasn't too bad. Then again, I had a strategy guide for both of those. Like, the actual booklet. Oh, yeah. I swear, I... Yes, I think I... I'm not sure if I still have them anymore. I think I kept the Zelda ones. When I got rid of them. So yeah, I'm clearly not telling you about telling you where to go. So just watch. Yeah, I, I I've always believed that actions speak louder than words, especially in a video. Yeah. <laughs> the commentary is more just for extra entertainment. Which I'm sure nobody cares about. I'm I'm not very entertaining. You never know. You're definitely not. Oh thanks. <laughs> Anytime. In all fairness, I've known you like the longest out of all the people I know. Really? More or less. Not counting my family. You have any friends when you're four? More or less. <laughs> <laughs> we're like, we're what, 19? No, you're 19 on Monday. Yeah. I'm turning 19, yeah. That doesn't mean much to most people who would watch this. Oh, yeah. <laughs> This isn't exactly a Canadian only thing. I know. But basically, where we live in Canada, you can drink at 19. Yep. Legally. In Ontario. You don't have to. Well, actually, half of the provinces have the same law. I know. Quebec. Uh, in Montreal? Uh, or not in Quebec. Quebec at 17. 18. It's 18? Yeah. Okay. In Alberta, I think it's 18. Yeah. Because yeah. half our graduating class went there for March break. <laughs> or at least my English class. Yeah. I, I thought it was funny. They were just talk, openly talking about like drinking all night and going to the casinos in front of my English teacher. And just like, have fun. <laughs> just didn't care. Yeah. It's not his job to care at that point. So yeah, the battery's running low. Oh, well there's a clue. We live in Ontario. <laughs> oh, the work. <laughs> yeah. All right, I forgot. I'm pre I've probably mentioned where we live at some point. Probably. If anything... If anything, it's probably like right on my YouTube channel. <laughs> I wouldn't be surprised. Like, if you put in 10 minutes, you could probably figure out what city I live in. Just from either clues or other videos that are on my channel. Yeah, it's actually really easy to find. Because, um... Unless you think it's Toronto. It's really wrong. No. <laughs> <laughs> actually, no, not entirely. But, um, Great Big C came to our... Came here. Yeah. And I found some videos of that concert, and they're, uh, they're listed as, as favorites. <laughs> okay, well, you can figure it out. Somehow. Yeah. Well, in all fairness, there was, a, there was an impromptu sing-along. Yeah. I had to find... I wanted to see if I could find that video. <laughs> but one person recorded them from different uh, cities. It was the same person. Yeah. So that person must have been, like, following them. Probably. Well, someone did get on stage and, and uh, hug the singer, so... <laughs> That was pretty funny. And they didn't care. There was like no security at that concert. Probably was. Okay, they weren't very obvious. No, no, people climbed up on stage. Someone someone handed them an, a, a letter to read. <laughs> they just, they did it. I think someone might have given them money. Wait, no, that was a real Big Fish concert I have oh. a DVD of. Yeah, someone threw packets of mustard at them. <laughs> like the little ones you find at like, um... Uh, what was... I got a hot dog stand. They don't have a mustard dispenser. They have those little packs. <laughs> yeah, someone threw one at them. I figured out, someone's throwing mustard at us. Do you think that's funny? <laughs> and it was. I'm not sure that's supposed to be a joke of something else, but... I didn't get it if it was. Right, those... Tornado barn looking things. It looks like a barn and a turbine combined. I don't know. Um... I think it's just a turbine. I know, but it has the red siding, so that's, oh. that's why I said it was a barn. Okay. 
But their tornado, it only moves for three spaces if you haven't counted them. Yeah, so hmm. at any second now, it's going to kick you back to the real world for a minute. And by real world, I mean the real world of the game, not... This isn't this isn't Metal Gear Solid. Wait, oh, no, you never played Metal Gear Solid, no. did you? In the second one, when you got near the end, it told you to turn off the system. You played this for too long. Really? Yeah. And then when you and when you died, it said uh, "fission mailed." Oh. You said a mission failed. That's where that joke came from. Zero batteries. Yeah, it takes a while for that to kick in, and I'm clearly lost in this area, so I probably could just sped this up. Although Windows Movie Maker only allows for 2x, 2x speed. I should really get CS4 off my friend who offered it to me. Mm. I'll probably just do it one day during our, one of uh, my mm. communication skills tutorial. It turns out he's in that too. <laughs> so I'll probably just go up there and one day like, yeah, can you just transfer this over to my computer now? Yeah, you're running your yeah. Microsoft Security Essentials fire scan. You're right here. This is where it finally kicks in, where the battery's gone. And this guy was making <laughs> a handheld generator while you were fighting. Oh, this is where you have to mash the B button. Yeah, the only time you have to mash B. Yeah, they only give you 20 seconds. And I th I think I fully charged the battery. Looks like you're out here. Right? Yeah, the first time I did it, I got to there in 20 seconds, because I was using my thumb. Like, Wait. no, like when I played on the Game Boy. Oh, yeah. Yeah, but I can, like, I played Bayonetta, and <laughs> you have to mash, mash X a lot. <laughs> and what I would do is I would take my hand off the controller and bash it with my index fin finger, the one you usually point with. Yeah, I would, okay, that's coming through, don't do that. <laughs> but yeah, I, that's what I did on my keyboard, because I have Z and X is A and B. It's actually kind of hard to use the emulator on this computer, because the arrow keys are right beside shift and one. And control and zero. So I sometimes hit those ones instead of the ones I'm looking for. Oh, you for. have a numpad. That sucks. I mean, that's good, but it sucks. Shit, I didn't even notice that. <laughs> you just said it was right beside the I know. <laughs> I know, but I don't pay. I didn't pay that much attention when I got it. I mostly just wanted a laptop that can run stuff. Like this thing has an integrated video card, so I doubt it will run anything. I wish I had a numpad. On your laptop? Yeah. It is true, they are extremely useful. Yeah. I use them on my home computer whenever I have to type in numbers. I just defer one thing only, but that's okay. It's, especially the calculator when you open it on Windows, because yeah. it also has the um, the backslash. Is that backslash or forward slash? I don't know. Alright, well the slash on the top of the number pad, that's divide. I'm going to the calculator. The asterisk, or cleany star if you're in computer science is multiplication then there's subtraction why is the addition button the same size as the enter key though that's my question because <laughs> all the others are the same size <laughs> look if, if you're wondering we're really stretching for information for things to talk about but then again we talk about stupid stuff like this normally yeah i swear there was i was probably just complaining about something really simple one day and wasn't even realizing it or i, I realized it right and there i forgot to put in the third battery <laughs> Alright, so the boss fight's next. Video's over. At least for us.